I'm married? To who? Rogan O'Leary. Um, maybe you could sign papers now. That's all you remember. Right. Yes. Why? You've been missing for two months. We should get married. Nothing that I want more than to marry you, but not like this. You're not ready. No, we're both not ready. I'm now Richard Castle. Private investigator. Thanks again for solving the case, Ricky. You and your associate. If that's it. That's it. Yeah? Yes. Hands where I can see him. Come on. Uh, what the hell is this? We're here to talk about Loxat. Kate. Yes, I can trust him, and so can you. No, not until we confirm. Her first command, Captain Kate Beckett. Now I have to do this on my own. And when it's done, I just, I hope that, I hope, I hope you'll have room in your heart to take me back. It's who you are that is. You're married to the captain of the 12th precinct where a certain work of art is being held. So what do you think? Maybe he was corporate security? Not with that tiny back seat. I mean... Captain Hoochie Mama? Her pheromone output went through the roof when she saw you. And we're gonna get her back. The only way I know how to do that. We're solving murders together, so I'm not going anywhere. That's <laughs> such a famous crime-solving duel. It will be a privilege to watch you work. Uh, well, sadly, we don't work together any longer. But it cannot be. Beckett without Kissel is like uh, Boris without Natasha. So there'll be time to hit the beach while we're in L.A., right? No, we're here to learn about my missing time. Uh, you know what? Why don't you just go to your P.I. office? Maybe Alexis and Haley have something that's worthy of inspiration. And it's a pretty small list. The only people with access to the entire budget are the comptroller. Really? Yeah, he was looking for a weapon. It's we have a homicide. You, me... In a crime scene, just as nature intended. All right, Captain, let's roll. Yeah, no can do. Captains have to multitask. In fact, I am due for a meeting with the DA, so why don't you meet up with the boys? We can debrief later. The light appeared in the crime scene photos, okay? In the exact same place. What really happened last night? What were you doing there when Haley and Marcus were breaking in? You might have better luck taking Castle with you. Ooh, <laughs> not falling for that trick again. Those women's prisons are nothing like the late night Skinamax movies, so have fun. So, what do you want to do now, Captain? Let's talk to the other contestants. Ryan, you're with me. Espo, it's you and Casa. So, we got 60 minutes to investigate this murder before we lose access to our crime scene. We got to divide and conquer. Right. Came up in a case. I just need a partner to go with me and locker room. A female partner, guys. Look, this doesn't mean that we're. No. No, I don't know. It's just a timeout from the timeout. Yeah. Yeah. How did we end up here again? You lie to protect me, I lie to protect you. Lying, life license. Castle, can you do me a favor? Stop talking. So if we're not talking, what are we doing? Close of Kayla's body bag. It's just a dream. Oh, yeah. Kath? 
Catherine, what on earth are you wearing? My outfit, your family tradition? Yeah, uh, you do know I was kidding about that, right? Then maybe it should be. Better put this on, Pilgrim. <laughs> Can I help you? Yeah, I'm Detective Beckett. This is my associate, Mr. Castle. Marco. Shut up. You hooked the very last word. Well, whatever you're doing, could you stop? You're scared of my work? No, I'm scared that I might murder you. They can get up. We gotta go. <laughs> you totally fell for it. Well, there's nothing I can do. She wasn't hurt, Castle. That's what Three children. Three kids? There's no way I'm gonna let you take care of our baby on your own. Every writer needs inspiration. And I found mine. Always. Always. Dad, Beckett, this is David. I know who the killer is. 